Welcome to Iraqi Dinar News, where we bring you the latest updates on the Iraqi Dinar and the economic landscape of Iraq. Today, we're diving into the recent high-stakes meeting between Iraqi and U.S. officials that has left many in Baghdad disappointed and frustrated. The outcome of this meeting has significant implications for the Iraqi economy, especially in light of the ongoing challenges. A nation under pressure, fluctuating oil prices, and geopolitical instability. Iraq is grappling with a series of economic hurdles. The nation's reliance on oil as its primary source of income means that fluctuating oil prices have a direct and profound impact on the economy. Over the past few months, volatile oil prices have caused significant instability, making it difficult for Iraq to plan and execute its budget effectively. Adding to this economic turmoil is the geopolitical instability in the region. Ongoing regional tensions and conflicts have further strained Iraq's economic recovery efforts. This instability not only affects domestic economic conditions, but also deters foreign investment, which is crucial for long-term economic growth and stability. Central Bank Struggles, Devaluation and Public Frustration the Iraqi Central Bank has been under immense pressure to stabilize the dinar and maintain economic stability. Recently, the dinar's devaluation has exacerbated inflation, leading to rising prices for everyday goods and services. This has placed a significant financial strain on Iraqi citizens, many of whom are struggling to make ends meet. Public frustration has reached a boiling point. The people of Iraq had high hopes for the recent meeting with U.S. officials, expecting measures that would offer immediate relief. However, the outcomes have fallen short of these expectations, leading to widespread disappointment and discontent. Meeting with U.S. Treasury A Missed Opportunity The meeting between Iraqi and U.S. officials was seen as a crucial opportunity for Iraq to secure support and relief measures for its struggling economy. The Iraqi government was hoping for immediate assistance that could stabilize the dinar and alleviate economic pressures. However, the U.S. Treasury's focus was primarily on long-term economic reforms rather than immediate relief. This emphasis on structural reforms, while important for the future, does not address the urgent needs of the present. There is a clear disconnect between the urgent need for short-term solutions and the proposed long-term strategies. Regulation of the foreign exchange market challenges ahead. One of the key discussion points was the regulation of Iraq's foreign exchange market. The thriving black market for U.S. dollars in Iraq has created a significant disparity in exchange rates, further complicating the economic situation. The U.S. Treasury emphasized the need for stricter regulations to curb illegal dollar transactions. However, implementing these regulations is a monumental task. The entrenched interests benefiting from the current system pose significant challenges to reform efforts. While regulation is essential for economic stability, the practicalities of enforcement and the resistance from vested interests make it a complex issue to tackle. Transparency and Governance, a complex issue. Improve transparency and governance within Iraqi financial institutions are critical for long-term stability. Corruption remains a pervasive issue, undermining efforts to reform and stabilize the economy. Addressing corruption and mismanagement is essential, but it requires a comprehensive overhaul of the financial system. Reforming the entire financial system is a monumental task that demands political will and sustained effort. It is not something that can be achieved overnight, and the complexity of the issue means that progress will be slow and challenging. Disappointment and moving forward, Iraqi perspective. The Iraqi foreign minister has expressed disappointment at the lack of immediate support following the meeting. There is a pressing need for short-term relief measures to alleviate the economic pressure on Iraqi citizens. The current situation requires immediate action to stabilize the dinar and address inflation. Conclusion, a strategic disconnect. In conclusion, there is a significant gap between Iraq's immediate needs and the U.S. Treasury's long-term vision. 
This disconnect has left many in Iraq frustrated and concerned about the future. As always, Iraqi Dinar News remains committed to providing you with the latest updates and in-depth analysis. Stay tuned for further insights on this developing story. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the Iraqi Dinar and the economic situation in Iraq.